I'm Darren Marlar, and this is your Daily Dose of Weird News. The latest issue of Time magazine features former Secretary of State Hillary Clinton on the cover in silhouette. The placement of Clinton's head under the M in Time appears to give the likely presidential candidate horns. Yeah, that uh, seems about right. The average U.S. adult scores about 50 percent on personal finance questions related to U.S. federal income tax returns. Most American adults get an F in understanding income tax basics, according to a NerdWallet survey. Respondents scored on average 51 percent in a 10-question quiz on tax basics related to such personal finance issues as retirement, college savings, and health care. Retirement? What the heck is retirement? Seriously, what, what's retirement? I have no idea what that is. A guy was thrown out of a Rhode Island bathroom by an explosion. Jeffrey Oppenheimer said, "...it happened in an instant, like getting hit by a cannon." Oppenheim said he suffered only a bruised knee from the incident. The cause of the explosion is unclear, although my guess would be the Taco Bell breakfast menu. Wait a minute. Oppenheim was in the exploding bathroom, and Oppenheimer created the atomic bomb? Come to your own conclusion. Fifteen gunmen in France pulled off a $9.5 million jewelry heist. Fifteen gunmen? It's hard enough to find even one guy who's willing to go jewelry shopping. These guys found fifteen? The latest site survey from eHarmony reveals that men who use the dating website are uninterested in women whose hobbies include using the computer, volunteering, reading, watching TV, and going to the movies. In short, men hate women whose hobbies include anything other than having sex with them. This is online dating. Wouldn't it be expected that the woman might enjoy using the computer? Police in Florida say a 27-year-old woman who was texting walked into the path of a freight train, was clipped, and thrown into the air but survived. Cops say Sheena Kenya appeared to be texting as she walked around the crossing gates and into the path of the passing freight train in broad daylight in Lakeland, Florida. She suffered a compound fracture to her right arm and her right leg was injured, but her texting thumbs are still okay, so it's all good. During a recent TV shoot in Lima, Peru, a television production crew videotaped a purple-colored disc-shaped UFO hovering in the distant sky near a construction site. So far, there's no official explanation for the object. Personally, I think this confirms my long-held theory that Barney the Dinosaur is an alien from the planet Dorcas. That's your daily dose of weird news. I'm Darren Marlar. Get more weird news anytime, anywhere at DailyDoseOfWeirdNews.com. You can join the Weird News Facebook group, download the free app for Apple or Android, sign up for my newsletter, visit me on Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, subscribe to my YouTube channel, hire me to voice your project for only five bucks and more. Check it out at DailyDoseOfWeirdNews.com. Until next time, keep it real. Weird. <laughs>